In this video I want to take a look at some viewing strategies and so I'm going uh, to go up here and I'll click on the view orientation and um, I'll set this to front view uh, so this is is my current uh, front view and uh, let's let's go in here and uh, I'm going to open up this uh, toolbar and place it on the screen and I'll have it pinned here uh, so that it it doesn't uh, disappear on me and uh, I'm going to click here on normal 2 and whatever face I have selected so let's say this face and I select normal 2 it rotates it around so that I'm looking perpendicular or normal to that face but suppose I want this line right here to be horizontal on the screen and so um, I'll uh, click that face I want to be normal too and then I'm going to hold down the control key and I'm going to select uh, this face and now when I do normal too it puts this line uh, horizontally and uh, so as long as the face isn't parallel to that face so I, I wouldn't select this one this one's parallel to it um, I'll, I'll hold down the control key if I select this face and I do normal too it's going to uh, put that face uh, horizontal so uh, when I've done this though, um, it, then I may want to give that a name so that I can use that. And uh, so if I click on new view, now I've already done this uh, one time and I called it primary, primary auxiliary. But um, so you could give that uh, a name and then return to that, uh, uh, that view. Um, just by selecting the named view and uh, then um, I've already done this so I'm going to delete this one um, and then when you go to do the drawing though these whatever named views you have will also be available for placing views on the drawing now let's look at a situation let's suppose that when you you do this that the object ends up uh, upside down or uh, when you when you click on one of the particular views maybe that orientation is with the object upside down and uh, so uh, what I could do is uh, set a set a new view and uh, let's let's say this view and um, I could um, uh, use the alt arrow keys to say if I rotated that around now let's say this is actually right side up uh, and I'll say update standard views and then I'll tell it I want this to be my front view and it'll give me a warning about the drawings I notice uh, X and Y it's not going to change X and Y but now it sets this as my front view now when I go to my other views if I come back here to front view uh, you know it, it's looking at this with the front view so you could redefine a, a particular view also um, to be uh, what you want to be is your front view or right side view or whatever and then um, uh, if I so if I if I uh, click normal to let me get this orientation here so if I, I click normal to here it, it goes like that um, if I click normal to um, you know so it, it's still uh, rotates that uh, around to that direction now, I'm not sure what I want to do here um, if I want to set back to a reset to the the standard views and uh, let's try uh, let's try setting this so I'm going to uh, hold down the control key I'll set that normal to and then I want to set that uh, as my actually I'm, I'm trying to well I'm trying to reproduce the issue so let's uh, let's rotate that around let's say I want that to be my front view and uh, so I'll say uh, update standard views and I'll say I want that to be my front view and uh, then so whenever I click on front view it'll rotate around to uh, that orientation um, hopefully some and then of course you can always then create uh, name views save views uh, hopefully something along that uh, line will allow you to orient your object 
um, however you normally want it to be uh, oriented.